Hey, ghouls and guys, it's Angela here, and I'm going to be showing you the Monster High Catacombs. Now, a lot of dolls can be displayed on here, so let's get started. I'll start with the first floor, and just to tell you, you need to assemble this, and you can't fold it. You have to take it apart and put it back together. So here's, I will show you the first floor. This is the first floor. Um, three dolls can be displayed in the first floor, so just to tell you, there's two of my inner monsters here, so this one is Linda, um, Linda Python, she's cute, and this is my other inner monster, this has to be my favorite, this is Rookie Brooks. And this catacombs playset has these little stands so you could stand the dolls up. And I also got Amanita Nightshade right here. Hello. So she's on the stand as well. So there's like this little chandelier. You could yeah, take it apart. You, there's these little slots and you put them together. And then there's the little hook here. So, um, this comes with a table, as well as the matching chair, so, this is it, it says Monster High right here, and this one just has cushion pins, so I have like this gamer set, so they could pretend like playing a game there's a little dice but the this game stuff does not come with the play set it's just the chair t and tables and candles so th there is this candle it's a big candle this comes with two candles actually three there's one super tiny one there's this big one and the medium one so this is the big one it has this little thing and it, it was like this in the playset, but again, there's this slot, and you can put it back together, so, there. So, this is, the, so, the thing that's cool about this playset is that you have to take all the furniture out that's on the carpet. Excuse me, I need to make shade. So, this is the ground, there's this thing, there's a carpet right here, and it turns into a marvelous pool, so you could have like a pool party. What's a party with no music? There's some, there's speakers here, two of them, excuse me, Rookie Brooks, so... Here is another display that you can do and you put the couch over there, and they can hang out over there, and then here's the pool party going on as well. So, as you're right there, I'm going to need to go there, and of course, Linda Python could stay here. Ugh. She is going to fall, so I'm just going to put her like this. <gasps> Ooh. And Rookie Brooks can stand here again. Oh my god. So, this is the first floor, but there is something cool. There's the clock and a door, and Amanita's face is right there. So, if you turn this thing all the way here... And it snaps. There's a secret room. And you see Bonita Femur right there. This is a freaky fusion catacombs. So, let's see. Harry Potter's butt. I mean, it's like Harry Potter's butt. So, this Bonita Femur. This is like the lab. Oh my gosh, that's too close. So, I'm just going to fix 
put it this way and show you the stuff that comes here first. So this is the little candle that I was talking about right here. This is a biology book. Is it a biology, biology? So it does not open, but it's still a pretty cool thing. And a book that is open with a stand. And to put everything on there, there is this little thing. So you have this, and then you put that there, and that there, the book there. Right there. So, I'll put it there. There is something missing. The bottom, the pen thing, like there's this octopus quail and the quail. Um, so, I, I lost the pen, so I'm not going to be showing that. Ugh. And here is this perfect Bonita femur. I'm just going to show the Freaky Fusion dolls. Bonita femur could just, like, be standing there um, on the lab thing. So, ugh. Just everything fell because I stand on it. And the new haunted dolls are out, so um, Harry Potter. Actually, it's not Harry Potter. Um, it's I forgot his name, but I know there's Porter. Porter something. I forgot. So there's are these cute shelves. Here are these cool shelves. If you see them, there they are, and this dragon. Do you see it? It's a dragon. So, moving on to the second floor. See the mirror? And, hmm, this is my mirror. Look at these cool detailed stuff. It's like stone and then it's cracks. If you walk up, look at, um, oh my gosh. Oops. Look at this piece. So it's really cool if you see it. And there's Kiyomi there, another painted doll. So, there is this stand. It goes up and down. So, like, a ghost could be there. Ah. Or, or, like, someone could be, like, if you have Drackey Becca, she could be, like, shooting down the stairs. But this is Kiyomi. Wee! Wee! So, moving on to the second floor. So hard. If do you see it, there is Elia Trotter. A fusion. Ah, look at my eyes. I love her eyes. They're just so detailish. Detailish. So this has another cushion chair. But this is smaller and it has this these bones. This is I have to say my favorite chair in this playset because I like the detail in front and there's a bigger pink cushion. And I love pink. Oops. Ooh. Um, there's clear space. And this thing has this table, purple table, and you put a map on it. There's this map. And there's something else right here. Lorna McNessie's luggage. I put it there. No. It's actually Marisol's. Marisol Coxie's luggage. There's something else here. It comes with this necklace. This gold necklace. 
so there's also the exchange students monster high those are their luggage suitcases so there oh there but look at this treasure map i mean look at it it has like this skelet leading all actually it has this pirate ship leading all the way to the skelet so there and then there is this entry It has the stand, and then someone can enter the catacombs. But my other inner monster, my last one, is Hirsch. Her name is Piper. Piper Watson. This is Piper. She's she's my second favorite. So let's let her sit down on the chair. Needs to take a rest. And then her legs are hanging out. The pool party. Oh no, she's about to fall in the pool. Splash. Okay, don't follow me. And then another dog could stand here, but um, I don't want it to stand there. There's something cool. See it? Do you see it? Do you see it? Oh no, the cat's disappearing. I'm just gonna turn it here so this cat spins if you turn the table. And I'll show you a different way. So, well, okay, so this is the good way. This is Nathan Rot, Your Majesty. He has this ponytail and another ponytail with a unicorn so he walks up the stairs okay I'm not gonna okay make him walk up the stairs there's Gigi there's Gigi okay this is really hard so you see Gigi just hanging and chilling, and then you see an elevator. So let me show you how that operates. You see the elevator? So here's Gigi. You put her on the elevator, but it's too small for her to put in. And what's really cool is that this is the girl stand. Okay. This is the girl stand for it. See, it that goes down. And then, in the back, you could have, like, Manny Tor in the elevator boys. So, I'm just going to use that for Gigi because, again, she is really tall. So, the elevator goes up and down. So, she goes, oh my gosh, she goes up, up the elevator. And then, there is a party! Another one. It's a garden party. So this is the garden party. There's C.A. Cupid and Elizabeth there. If you see her and her. So, this has a turning table. Let me put this all down. There is a turning table. Uh, there it is. This is a turning table. Oh, sorry. Did you see the turning table? Did you see the turning table? It's a pink skelet. So, there it is. It's a pink skelet, and then it turns, and it moves the kitties down below on this bar. So... I'm going to show you the accessories. Oh no, the camera's sitting on it. Oh, excuse me. I hurts. Sorry, took a little lift. And there. There's a mug. Here is the white mug. You go... And the punch bowl. 
and then there's some baked goods. So I'm going to put those up. So there are two of these little chairs that the doll can sit in while they're eating in the garden party. That's where Elizabeth and Sea Cupid were sitting. So, thank you for watching the Catacombs video. 